Actress Gina Rowland's son Nick Cassavetes, who helmed his mother in 2004's The Notebook, claims that his mother has Alzheimer's disease. The actor and director claimed to Entertainment Weekly that it was crazy that his mother, who now battles the degenerative disease herself, played a character in the classic romance who was suffering from cognitive decline. My mother, who is currently 93 years old, played the older version of Rachel McAdams' character in the movie. We spent a lot of time talking about Alzheimer's and wanting to be authentic with it, and now, for the last five years, she's had Alzheimer's, Cassavetti said to EW. She has complete dementia. We lived it, she acted it out, and now it's all on us. It's ridiculous. The most prevalent type of dementia, accounting for up to 70% of the 55 million cases worldwide, is Alzheimer's disease. The National Institute on Aging states that it is caused by a combination of age-related changes in the brain, along with genetic, environmental, and lifestyle factors, however a conclusive explanation has not yet been found. The Mayo Clinic estimates that 6.5 million people in the United States, 65 and older, have Alzheimer's, with more than 70% of those patients being 75 years old and older. Get the best of people, from celebrity news to gripping human interest stories, sent straight to your inbox by subscribing to their free daily newsletter. After receiving two nominations and an honorary Academy Award in 2015, Roland said that her mother Lady's battle with Alzheimer's almost prevented her from playing the iconic older Allie in the recently celebrated 20th anniversary of The Notebook. The Notebook, which is based on Nicholas Sparks' novel, was especially challenging for me because I portray an Alzheimer's patient. I don't think I would have gone for it if Nick hadn't directed the movie, based on what I went through with my mother, she stated in an interview with O Magazine in 2004. It's just too difficult. It was a challenging yet fantastic film. Similar opinions were expressed by Cassavetes, who told EW that the film holds up pretty good after 20 years. It's always a shock to learn that as much time has gone by as it has, but it makes sense. Simply put, I'm glad it exists, he said to the publication. It seems to have worked, he stated, and I'm very proud of it.